So in this border we've got a few plants of Verbena bonariensis. You can see how well they grew last year and because we've had such a mild winter they're shooting away again but they're very tall and scraggly and frankly they need getting under control now so they can grow in a more upright fashion and generally make better plants when they start to flower much later in the summer. So if we just start with this, this plant here and what we're going to try and do is look down the stem to see where we've got where is the lowest down decent shoot and I think if we take this main stem down to there and this one probably down to there um, So what are we left with? We've got a nice, a nice viable shoot coming from the stem down there. And I think if we clean up these stems, you'll see more shoots come from them, which I think will take that down a bit further. We cut the dead out as well. And we've got one good shoot there. Hopefully we'll get some more shoots here. Uh, we might just pinch that shoot out, pinch the top of it out so that it comes up in a more bushy fashion. Some years you'd find this plant had died right down to ground level. This year it hasn't. It may be that it's trying to shoot from the base and you can see one little shoot coming from down there. Hopefully now we'll get a good bushy new plant. And if we go back to this rather larger one over here, we can already see some quite vigorous new growth coming very high but frankly if that was to grow on it's all going to flop over, we're not going to see the flowers, it's completely out of control and we need to be just as ruthless with this one as we were with the last one. So there's a nice shoot on that, that little twig, reasonably low down and I think we'll take that as a level so we now we needed to cut out the bit of the dead. Um, we haven't gone down quite as low with this plant as with the other one. A few bits of dead to remove. Just to encourage the new shoots to come from those nodes in the stem. And actually I think we ought to take that down a little bit lower. I think we'll get a better plant at the end of the year if we do. So I'm going to snip it back a second time and we've only got one vigorous shoot there but if you think of all the energy that was going up into the plant that'll now transfer itself into bold new shoots and again I expect to see a few coming from ground level. We want to get more shoots, a bigger bushier plant but one that's not under control and not all over the place as they were before we started.